Hey y'all. Um, I thought I'll make a video about grass. Because grass is where it's at. Grass is basically the center of the freaking universe, motherfucker. Alright? So, I got grass. When I mo moved into my house, grass was dead, man. Grass was dead full of weeds. Right? It was yellow, brown, all the colors but green. Right, so what happened was is in time what I did is I, I brought in soil, I fertilized it, I watered it, I put down seed, I did all this work, right, and up came the grass. And when the grass came up, I mowed that mother way down, and it became thicker and thicker and thicker and softer and um, and greener too, you know, and. Um, what happened was, um, the grass turned out real nice. Now, in uh, here and there, you know, I've neglected it sometimes, and it's I've uh, it's shown it right because the grass start to die, the weeds start to come. But the interesting thing about grass is that when you look after grass, you water it, you fertilize it. What happens is two things. One is that the root system gets real strong and the other thing is that the thick grass on top um, and the um, thick root system underneath uh, make the war like the surface will get dry but deep underneath the uh, the, the it'll get it'll keep the moisture in right like like uh, mulch or something and that grass will sort of get to the point where weeds can't grow in it because the surface is dry because of what I just said and they can't the seeds can't get to the water the moisture deep underneath because they have to like be burrowed down to do that they can't just land on the top and what you get is you get grass that um, weeds can't they don't really grow. I guess they could grow, and once a blue moon, maybe I do get one. I just don't notice it. But yeah, the grass actually just looks after itself, and you don't get weeds as long as you look after it. Now, in saying that, you know, I, I do a lot of work to try to get up that stand. I needed to weed it like hell. Because and 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 the one thing is, if you don't pull the whole weed out, if you just take out the bits you can see, instead of the root, the real root, it'll um, it'll come back ten times faster because now it's got a system installed under deep underneath that can absorb all these nutrients around it um, that's stronger than the little tiny leaf that they're gonna pop out the top, so they come back like with a vengeance so you gotta make sure you get to the root of that and not just the bits you can see on the top you know but once you do that and you you look after it um you get the softest grass you get good times on that grass too you know like you wouldn't have a picnic on dead grass would you that's crazy but i mean i had i had a picnic with a beautiful woman once on that grass and we had a great time we had a such a great time we were eating cheese. I think we may, may maybe we had some wine. I can't remember, but we were having we were enjoying ourselves. We were enjoying ourselves. I was in my robe, in my comfort of my front yard. What more could man want? Beautiful woman, cheese, thick grass, robe, done. But didn't get there by accident. And if I if I don't keep deliberately looking after it, it's gonna go shit. So what being the weird old tripper that I am, I put I put two and two together with things that don't really even go to go together, you know, like I think of changing tires and think how that's that's really deep meaningful conversation, you know, about my soul or my life or whatever. And how it relates to everything that's around us now. So, and, and this is no different, you see, because y'all know, y'all know who who know me well know I 
recently gone through some crazy times the last couple of years. Uh, the T's, oh, the terrible T's, they've caused havoc on my mind. They have planted them weeds and they've sucked me dry. So I'm, I'm left with nothing but uh, yellow, <laughs> yellow brown grass all through my mind instead of nice thick green soft grass well mowed nice and short but fluff you know and I've worked hard you know to to get it from that now that I've removed the source of the problems um, I'm now able to focus on myself and I'm focusing hard right because I've got goals I've got ambitions and nothing's gonna stop me nobody and the best thing to do is like yeah I'm, I'm gonna pull every weed that I see <laughs> like I'm got time for shit I'm got time for weeds all they do is slow down my prog progress and make my outlook look browner and browner right so and the thing is as well is that I want everyone to be at this level I mean, I've got my ups and downs too. I'm not perfect, but but I want everyone to be at this level all the time with this perspective of life, you know. So what y'all need to do is pull them weeds, <laughs> put down that fertilizer in your mind, you know. Really take care of yourself, and if you need a hand, I'm here. I mean. I will not do all the work because that's not helping no one it's not your, your mind's not mine it's not my property your mind's your property but I'll certainly give you advice on you know I'm not no expert horticulturist but I'll, t I'll give you advice on what fertilizer to put down on how to how to pull out them dang weeds they and to get the root out and all that I'm right here and that's a genuine genuine um, thing <laughs> what's the word uh, offer that's a genuine offer so y'all need help y'all just call me I'm here you message me whatever genuine straight up no bullshit let's pull them weeds let's get strong let's focus on our goals and our things that will make our lives fulfilled not just this bullshit chatter the weeds fucking put in your mind, fuck that, fuck that, let's get strong together, have a great day y'all, 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 oh y'all, 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 y'all,